What's up guys? Welcome to episode 1 of my new series, um, I'm going to be doing an ultimate team. At the moment it's called Road to the Briskillers, uh, that's what I, that's all it's called for now because I can't think of a better name um, yet, but if you've got a better name or um, you feel like you've got a better name, uh, you want if you want to leave a comment, that'll be nice. I'll have a look and um, take it into consideration, and I'll be willing to rename it if I think it's good enough. You know, um, what I want to touch upon about is what the series is going to be about. Okay, so it's called Road to Briskillers at the moment. I said um, you're probably guessing from that it's something to do with Brazil and possibly Skillers, and that is that is it in a nutshell, really. Um, as you can see at the moment, I'm just sorting out my team, trying to get the best chemistry. But um, yeah, so what I'm going to do throughout the series is you're going to be watching me um, play games and eventually um, make my team into a Brazilian skill team. Um, and by that is, well, what I mean by that is um, a lot of five star skillers and because that is sort of my play type my play type skill base now um, it never used to be but recently I sort of tried to find a bit of try to get a bit more fun out of the game because I was getting bored of like you know the same sort of gold teams constantly changing my team because I got bored of it um, so I sort of forgot about sort of through the idea of making the best team possible out the window and I just just wanted to make it a bit more fun so you know grab some Brazilian Brazilvers as they call them uh, the Brazilian silver cards with like five star skills and I uh, bought them and it, I found it really fun and since then I've just been playing with team um, playing with players five star skill moves and making my skills better and stuff like that so yeah so throughout this series you're going to see me be buying all the like most of the five star skill Brazilian players and uh, see what I can do. But here, this is my first game, you see, and um, it's a bit of a well, you'll you'll see towards the end. I got I got very annoyed because I end up dominating the guy, and then he just he doesn't quit, which I'd have also hated if he did. But um, nice save for my keeper there. Um, yeah, he doesn't quit. What he does is is probably one of my pet hates. One one of my most hated things about FIFA is people that you beat them, you you're winning, and they uh, just leave their controller. They don't quit game. They just leave their controller. Um, and that's what he did the end. I was a bit unlucky there, not to get a penalty. I thought I felt I maybe should have done. And obviously, Briz, um, bronze players not very good free kick takers. Um, yeah, so at the end. What he does is leaves his controller and it takes ages f for the game to finish. And I think I kind of forgot I was playing bronze players then because I went for a 30 yard blinder but didn't work. And what was that? Seriously, threw on goal, finessed it over the bar. Don't know what I was doing to be honest. But, um,. A nice little bit of play here. I think this is my goal. Yeah, I do apologise for the uh, the sweaty goal as they call it, the um, pass pass back. But you know, bronze player, you got to take your chances with bronze players. If you if you know you can score, then obviously you're gonna do it. But um, yeah. So also, I wanted to say, so, oh sorry, here's a bit of a bit of poor defended by me. Just let him through like that. And he gets his uh, he gets his goal. But what I wanted to say is um, I do apologise for the quality of the video. video. Um, I've only I haven't actually got a Hapage HD PVR or anything like that. I've got an easy cap little crappy capture guard, which is why the quality is so bad. And nice little goal straight from kickoff here. The bit of skill, maybe it's a bit too easy to be honest. Shouldn't let me through like that. But nevertheless. Great little finish of a bronze player. Superb finish. Um, yeah, so I do apologise for the quality of the video. Hope it hasn't really um, prevented you from seeing anything. I think it is still, obviously, you can still 
see stuff quite easily but it's just not HD not as crisp as like HD PVR quality and stuff like that but, um, yeah so I'm through on goal here should have scored again put it wide now I don't know if that's just because it's a bronze player but I did have a few bad shots in this game and this look at that ball that is a quality ball and an amazing finish really impressed with that goal um, yeah from a bronze player to put a ball through like that don't see that often and then that even even that finish great little finish over the keeper obviously bronze keeper couldn't do much about that but great little finish nevertheless and uh, from here on I think he starts to just get annoyed I'll try and be a bit cocky here though what I was doing Look, could have shot again no end up getting a free kick but nothing comes of that Um. yeah so the get the best sort of the best skillers um or well, not the best some good five star skill people that I'm hoping to get during the series um, very early on you'll see me um, I think it's at the end of this episode you'll see me by Rafael Sobis. Now he is an amazing player, one of my favourite players on the ultimate team. Um, and I, you can pick him up between 400 and 700 easily by now. Um, and he's amazing. He's got so, he's so fast. You know, he's really quick. Got five star skill moves. Um, I think he's even got flair. I'm not sure. I'm not too sure about that, but I think he has. Um, and he's like, look, you'll see. Look, I'm buying him here. 700 and no, 750 by now. Can't go wrong with that. And you'll see me tear teams apart of it in future episodes. Um, he really is a great player to get. I really highly recommend him. You go out and buy him now. You won't be disappointed. And um, that draws episode one to a close, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you liked it, and uh, subscribe. Cheers.